Welcome everybody to NXT. And this is how you kick off the show. It's the king of strong style, Shinsuke Nakamura. And what a way to start NXT. With this man, the most enigmatic, the most charismatic, and the biggest international sensation, perhaps to ever sign with NXT or the WWE. And look at Full Sail going absolutely crazy for Shinsuke Nakamura. You've got to wonder exactly what Shinsuke has in mind. Why is he here? And I've heard whispers in the backstage area that we are going to find out exactly why Shinsuke is in NXT. But I don't think it takes a genius to figure out why. And it's very clear Shinsuke Nakamura is here to be the NXT champion. And boy, doesn't that make things interesting. But right now, we have Neville. And he's going to take on Kevin Owens. He called out Kevin Owens after last week's pop-up powerbomb. And after the interference in the match, and Neville's here for revenge. Oh, look out. Kevin Owens. Kevin Owens is right behind Neville. Look out. Oh man, right from behind, huge clothesline. And Kevin Owens is taking it right to Neville here. Is there anything this guy won't do to get the upper hand? Kevin Owens has completely lost it in NXT. He has not been the same since losing that NXT championship as he throws Neville down the ramp. And now Neville looks like he's gonna try and fight back here with an elbow to the gut of Kevin Owens. But Kevin Owens stops that shot and gives him one of his own. And Owens picks him up. Oh no, no, not on the ramp, oh my God. And Owens is trying to take it to him, but Neville counters. Neville trying to fight back, but Owens too strong. Look out, just a body block. And look at the arrogance of Kevin Owens. This is ridiculous, they were meant to have a scheduled match. And instead, Owens is just tearing him apart. This is ridiculous, and I'm glad someone has stepped in. Oh, look out. For the second week in a row, it's Triple H, and he must be just fed up with everything. Just fed up with Kevin Owens. What he's been trying to pull, he's been trying to do everything to get his hands back on that NXT Championship and he may have just stepped over the line because here is the boss, here is Triple H. And a small update on William Regal as well. He has been dispatched from the hospital and he will be here in attendance in the very next episode. So let's hear what the game, I'm glad they've been separated. Let's hear what Triple H says.
Well, a bombshell announcement from Triple H. He has announced that the main event for the NXT Championship at Supremacy will be a triple threat match. Ryan Lusk defends against both Shinsuke Nakamura and Kevin Owens. Unbelievable announcement. You gotta wonder what Ryan Lusk thinks about all of this. He is a fighting champion, but his odds have been slashed of walking out of supremacy with that NXT championship so shortly after he won it. Shinsuke Nakamura has worked his way into the main event. But Kevin Owens, you gotta think, has really just bought this on himself completely. Kevin Owens, arguably, is fighting for more than an NXT championship. He's fighting to stay in NXT. He's fighting for the right to be part of the hottest brand in sports entertainment. And this man, Ryan Lust, stands at the top. He's been quite silent, but his silence is deadly, and he lets his actions do the talking. What an announcement from Triple H. Triple threat match at Supremacy for the NXT Championship. Three of arguably the biggest stars in the world of wrestling. Absolutely incredible. But right now, the main event for tonight is also a triple threat match. So we get a little taster of what's to come at Supremacy. It'll be Kevin Owens. It'll be Neville. And it'll be Ryan Lusk. Let's get it on. Oh, and look out, Kevin Owens, look at that, straight out of the ring. Where the hell's Kevin Owens going? Kevin Owens is, is he, he's walking out on this match. Kevin Owens is walking out on this match. He's got, Kevin Owens is leaving. He is leaving the building. What the hell is going on here? Kevin Owens has just left the building and he's left Ryan Lusk and Neville to juke it out. I guess technically this is still a triple threat match. Triple threat matches are no disqualification. Kevin Owens has just walked out of the building. No doubt in protest that he has to fight off two challenges for his career. And look at that uppercut from Ryan Lust straight into the cover on Neville. I guess we've got to focus on the action at hand here. There is still a match going, but the bigger story is that Kevin Owens has walked out on this match. He may have even... I don't, I don't know, where, where the hell has Kevin Owens gone? I mean, he's got to go past Triple H at some point, surely. We've got to focus on this match here as, as Ryan Lusk is lighting up Neville here with shots and forearms, those stiff forearms of Ryan Lusk, the very famous forearms of Ryan Lusk. And look out, oh, and a big clothesline. And a cover straight away. Ryan Lusk trying to end this early. You want to try and preserve your energy. Try and end matches quickly in the lead up to a huge triple threat match at Supremacy for the NXT Championship. Oh. And not only that, not only is Kevin Owens' career on the line in NXT, the NXT Championship is on the line, plus it's the in-ring debut of Shinsuke Nakamura. It gets absolutely no bigger than that. As Neville has him in a headlock here, and oh, and a perfect. Absolutely picture perfect snap suplex. Oh, and there's that innovative high flying offense, almost gymnastic like offense of Neville with a standing shooting star press. Unbelievably impressive. Neville lifts him up now and drops him down with a delayed suplex. Beautiful move from Neville, one of the most undoubtedly talented wrestlers in the world. And look out! Snapping that neck back, and Neville is in firm control of Ryan Lusk, much like last episode as well. Oh, and now Neville, now Neville's lighting him up, lighting him up with kicks here. Neville rolling him over onto his stomach. And a shot to the back of Ryan Lusk. Right, I don't know what happened there. We just lost picture for a second. Not quite sure. I apologize for that. We just lost our picture. But look out. Lusk picks him up, oh, and slams him down onto his face. 
Incredible offense in this match. Ryan Lusk, he thinks that's enough and it just might be. Oh, he doesn't even get a one count. And now Lusk, he mounts the middle rope. Ryan Lusk diving off, but Neville swept him to the side. And now Neville picks him up again. And another one, another delayed suplex. The blood rushing to the head and then he slams to the mat. And Neville, oh my goodness me. A corkscrew moonsault, standing corkscrew moonsault. That might do it, he's got him too. Oh, and Ryan Lusk just kicks out at 2.9. What a match, what a fast paced match this is, much like last episode. Neville getting so close. And now Ryan Loss with a suplex of his own. Loss picking up Neville. Oh, that one of those big forearms again. They are unstoppable, those forearms, and there's another one. And now Lusk whipping in Neville. What's he gonna do here? He sets him up, oh, and spins him around. What a back body drop that was. The torque on Neville's back. One, he might have him. That might be enough, it's just two. And Neville gets out again. What a match here. Now Ryan Lusk is gonna try and ground Neville. That's smart. Neville's best offense is in the air and when he's moving quickly. But if you could ground him and try and grind him down, that's the best way to beat Neville and he just smashes him into the turnbuckle and then straight into the cover again and that might be enough he really smashed Neville's back off the turnbuckle but he gets out at barely two so it's going to take a lot more than that to put Neville away with a chop there and now lighten him up again and another chop and another punch and another chop red raw chest of Neville and Neville fights back he grabs Ryan Lusk, sends him into the corner. And what's he got planned here? He's going to load him up to the top rope. Oh, and just paint brushes him across the face. What? What is Neville thinking here? Oh, no, 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 no. Don't do it. Oh, my God. A superplex from the top rope to the floor. Oh, my God. Neville. He may have ended this right here. What an incredible move. And Neville, it just shows how much he wants to get back in the title picture here on NXT. And Neville again, he picks him up and another delayed suplex. This time it's on the mat. And I guarantee you that offers no protection from the concrete floor. And Neville in firm control. And he wants to take this back in the ring. And Ryan Lusk has to hobble back to the ring after that superplex to the floor. And here's Neville again. And he picks him up again. Is it another delayed suplex? It is. And I don't know how much more Ryan Lusk can take. He's in a lot of trouble here. And Neville, he's going to go to the top rope. This is where he's at his most dangerous. Neville on the top rope. What's he looking for? Oh, my God. A perfect shooting star press into the cover one. He's got him too. Lusk is done. No, he just gets out at 2.9. Neville cannot quite put him away. Oh, look out! Straight out of Lusk. Straight out of Lusk. Completely out of nowhere. Into the cobble. Neville's done. One, two. And that's it. No, Neville ekes out at 2.9 as well. Oh, my God. What a match here. This is incredible. Ryan Lusk. Oh, he got him. And right across the top of the back. And now Lusk. Go into the apron. What's he looking for? He leaps off. Oh, and he lands on the back of Neville with his elbow, but he may have done more harm to himself. Ryan Lusk is trying to struggle to his feet here. Neville is still down. What a war. Neville drags himself up and Lusk with a raking right hand. And then another one of those forearms. And Lusk, we've seen this before, off the rope. And yes, the drop kick. Straight to the head of Neville. That could be it. I think Neville might be concussed one. And he gets the ropes. Neville with that ring presence. That veteran-like ring presence. Lusk 
Picking him up to his feet and then lighting him up with another hand. Oh, and look at the chop again. And another one of those forearms. And another one. And Neville has taken so many blows to the head. And Rusk with a backbreaker. Now, what, what is Ryan Lust thinking here? He's gone to the middle rope. Lust to the middle rope. And this time he lands the senton. And I reckon Neville's in huge trouble here. Neville is in huge trouble. And Lusk, he's going to go for it. He's going to go for it. Yes! From Melbourne with love on Neville. And now he's going to line him up. And he's going to end it right now. He's going to end this match right here. Oh, no. Neville. Neville got out of the way. Neville got out of the way of the straight out of Lusk. And Neville with a snap mare. Oh, and a shot to the back. And now Neville to the top rope. Neville's going to go for the red arrow. Can he hit the red arrow? Oh, Lusk moved. Lusk moved. I think he may have. No, he did. I don't think he caught him. He didn't catch him. Lusk is in wait here. Ryan Lusk hooks him up. Oh, and a big suplex. And he stays alive. And now what's this? Ryan Lusk has got to go to the top rope. Ryan Lusk to the top rope. What's he thinking? Oh, my God. 450 splash into the cover. One, two, got him. No, Neville kicks out at 2.9. And Ryan Lusk is firing up. But so's Neville. Neville with a head block. Neville takes him to the corner. Oh, and, oh look who's on the entranceway. Look who's on the entranceway. It's Kevin Owens. Neville into the cover of a super German suplex. Two, got him. Three, no. Ryan Lusk eeks out, but here's this son of a bitch Owens. Kevin Owens has come here right at the end of the match. And look out. He picks up Lusk. Oh, straight onto his back. Straight onto his back. Look out, Neville. Oh no, he's not going to come in and pick up the pieces. And a, oh, and a package pile driver to Neville. A package pile driver to Neville. And what's he? Oh, and he just throws Neville like a piece of garbage to the outside. Look out, look out, look out. He rolls up, he rolls up last. He rolls up last two. No, not this way, damn it. Kevin Owens. He walked out on the match. And then come back right at the death. This was the moment. This was the moment that he picked. This incredible move from Neville to Ryan Musk. High impact. And look at him walking down like the coward that he is. Just sauntering down to the ring. And he was very nearly too late as Ryan Lusk just kicks out. But there you see it. The package pile driver to Neville. And then he just discards him. This was Kevin Owens' plan all along. He just discards Neville to the outside and then rolls up Ryan Lusk from behind, I might add for the one, two, three. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. And look at him celebrate like he's earned a victory. Didn't he? He wasn't even in the match. He walked out right at the start. And Kevin Owens has come back and stolen this. But his career is on the line at Supremacy.